This week, the U.S. Wheat Associates is hosting its Latin American and Caribbean Wheat Buyers Conference here in beautiful Portland, Oregon. Alan Tracy is the president of the U.S. Wheat Associates and says export markets like these are very important to farmers in states like Montana. Our U.S. wheat producers rise and fall based on our export success. And here's a market which now is taking 40% of all total U.S. exports, is growing, and uh, uh, we, we believe has the potential to continue to grow in the future. Furthermore, this is a market that buys on the basis of quality. Chris Colstead is a director of the Montana Wheat and Barley Committee and farms near Ledger, Montana, and says he's proud to raise high quality wheat for customers like those in Latin America and the Caribbean. They're looking for quality wheat and they know the United States is a reliable you know, producer and they can come to the United States and get this wheat. A lot of times they'll find uh, maybe cheaper wheat elsewhere, but it doesn't result in the quality products that they want to give to their consumers. It's a great feeling to know that, that we in Montana are helping to feed the world and uh, providing them with you know, good quality products. Probably makes all that hard work and sweat worthwhile. So when you stop and think about the fact that 80% of all the wheat that's grown in Montana is exported somewhere else, I think it's safe to say that export markets like Latin America and the Caribbean are very important to Montana's number one industry, agriculture. Reporting from Portland, Oregon, I'm Russell Nemitz.